Broken Arrow schools are campaigning voters in the district this election day for a $52 million bond election. It's four different propositions. Two News Oklahoma's Samson Tamajani joins us live outside Sequoia Middle School with a look at what's on the table. Samson. Yeah, Karen, the district is calling this campaign the Secure Our Future bond. It calls it an easy choice, as many school districts will do, except this main talking point being that it won't raise any taxes. We're at a point now where there's things that our school district needs and we need it vitally. Principal Nathaniel Hutching says in the first three years of Rosewood Elementary, the student population ballooned to almost 600 kids. So if the addition was here, we'd be walking into the what we would call the Red Wing. Proposition 3 of the 2023 BAPS bond would not build another elementary school, but add more classrooms at current ones like Rosewood. Hutching says it's a smarter choice. Our students need and would benefit from having lower class sizes and uh, teachers would be able to uh, effectively teach those kiddos in their class. It's not just a growing population the district claims needs fixes. It says other campuses have growing roof leaks and dire HVAC needs. That combined with new high school fine arts and tennis centers, as well as security and technology updates, makes for Proposition 1 totaling $48 million. As a voter, as long as taxes aren't going up, I'm good with it. Required money for the bond measure would come from keeping the same tax rates on residents in the district. That's enough to convince some parents we talked to Monday, like Andy Sanchez. I had no idea about the roofs. That makes me a little nervous. Mold and stuff like that. I don't want my daughter to be anywhere where that's happening. Sounds like a good idea to me. Now there are two other propositions included in this vote for the school district. Prop 2 dealing with $4 million for buying new school buses, while Proposition 4 deals with figuring out the location of a future competition swimming pool. And again, the election date is November 14th. Live in Broken Arrow, Samson Tamajani, 2 News, Oklahoma.